Who taught you to write? Who makes their best attempt to nudge you in the right direction in life? What occupation is so important that the fabric of society would crumble with the absence of them? Teachers. Currently, there's been a slowly decreasing number of educators for not only Escambia, but Santa Rosa County as well. So much so that they are holding a teacher hiring event from March 11th to the extended date of April 19th. According to PensacolaNewsJournal.com, there is a 35% reduction in teachers enrollment between 2009 and 2014. Two factors that led to this problem are the pay slash budget and growing career choices. According to BLS.gov, high school teachers make an average of $57,000 per year, Scambia and neighboring counties make lower than the national average. As technology increases, more and more lucrative job opportunities open up and demand for people told them increase. The amount of students that want to become teachers could potentially become a lot less. Escambia has been trying to sway teachers in by an online screening process that could potentially tackle the dilemma for not only our county, but an attempt for the entire statewide shortages. That's not all that's been done to assist the program, though. Here at Pine Forest, we have the Future Teacher Academy to get involved with students who are interested in following a career in teaching and show them what it takes to become adequate educators in the future. Recently, I've been given the privilege to speak to Ms. Johnson of the Future Teacher Academy and one of her students on behalf of the lack of teachers. What's your hypothesis on the lack of teachers? There's so many reasons why there are not enough teachers right now. A lot of it has to do with only having an annual contract and teachers want more job security. There's also a lot of opportunities out there for people to do things other than teaching with their degrees. And so it has to be an ideal environment to come into. You're either dedicated to it or you're just not dedicated to it. Do you think that the Future Teacher Academy can actually do some good to bring in new teachers? Oh, I think it's going to do great things for bringing teachers in, but more importantly for retaining teachers because the skills that we are teaching them are things that brand new teachers have a very difficult time with. So this will make their first year teaching a great experience. So out of all the students you have in the academy, how many do you think are actually committed to becoming teachers? Well, that depends on which level. In the first year, I probably retain about half. The second and third year students, almost, I would say 95% are will hang in there till the end. What's a factor that makes you worry about becoming a teacher? I'd probably have to say about all the planning, all the learning of the student themselves of how they're going to learn because each person has their own unique style of learning. For all the future teachers listening in, just remember you'll be given the opportunity to mold the minds of countless students for generations to come. For all the current teachers listening in, thank you. I'm Brian, back to you anchors.